Hello everyone, welcome back to Gladius Relics of War. Just before I hit end turn, we're going to try giving this 17% uh, damage. Their current damage is 2.4. And now it is 2.7. Well, I guess that's 17%. <laughs> hmm. Bonus armor for you. Well. You'll get the same. What did you guys get? No, you got the extra attack, so that's fine. Shooting them in an outpost when they've moved. It's probably not going to cause many casualties. <laughs> uh, where's this? Oh, you guys are over here. You can just sit. It doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, you're the, the big spidery thing. Okay. Um, how do I get Havocs there? Uh, put in that. You've got all your, yes, you've got all those, all your tiles you can get. You are going to need more. Oh, you're building that. I mean, four turns. And you are full of population, so you we can just. Yeah. It's fine. Okay, oh, we've got an extra vehicle armor. That should put all these up to Nine. Yeah. You're not going to kill. You can get him. Uh, not up there particularly. Oh, here we are. Liar. Maybe I'll have to. Oh, you can shoot too. Send that uh, flyer after the wasp. You look like you were shooting here then. <laughs> Whatever. Doesn't matter. Um. Right. You've got your increase in that. Your loyalty's going down. If we stick more loyalty somewhere. That should uh, buff up everything else that we get. Anyway, I want to get another one of them because I want to see if I can actually get it into some more action. Just to see what it's like against different enemies. Other than that, doesn't matter. 
And you grab another tile. Right, get some research. Right of blood. That's another one of uh, things like this that I'm probably not going to use at the moment. I can see the point of them, just not not in this particular campaign. Uh, in Princes, Defiles, Hellbrutes, Small Fiends, Venom Crawls, and Warp Talons. Icon of Despair increases melee damage reduction against fearful enemies to be unit with a mark of Nurgle. That sounds kind of specific. There's your level 3 city tile grabbing, obliterators. I'm going to get that, does not yes. Smoke launchers for rhinos and defilers. Range damage reduction, temporal distortion, and that's another boon. Well, obliterators it is. That was 250. If I can get a bunch more research. But not yet. Probably want to get them, but they can wait. And of course, those wasps have run away again. Here they are. Um, over here, I saw a lot of dogs and things turning up. I have got a hell of a lot of spawn thanks to this dude here. <laughs> can you see them from anywhere? You can, I don't know that I really want them there though. <laughs> Should have known. I think it's slowed down again. Guff, guff. Alright, uh, it's worth seeing what we can do against this. Probably need to get some infantry with melter bombs in or something. I'm running out of infantry with melter bombs. They're all sort of <laughs> elsewhere. Actually, you go there, do that. Soul Blaze. I'm going to leave you alive in the hopes that you will actually end up... that the Soul Blaze will finish you off. I can see what that does. And you can just... Sit there for now. Over here, you guys are all fine. You guys all moved, didn't you? Yeah. 
So this, building that. Three turns, three turns. I don't really need another one of them. Uh, over here. Yep, you can't really do much at the moment. And you, in theory, if this was a real campaign, I'd be building the uh, army creation buildings in there, but uh, we don't need to worry too much about that. I can't tell if that unit died or not. <laughs> I completely missed it. You know, having said that, I probably won't need to build those buildings there. That would get them closer to the front, so that I could uh, get these units in quicker and see how good they do. over here do I have another chance to see <laughs> okay, if you do them first then you might turn him into a spawn that's what we like to see you go there finish them off. Um, just do as much damage as I can. You can't see anyone, that's unfortunate. Should have taken advantage of their fast movement actually. <laughs> Get that Lord in there though. What do you have? You have. Yeah. We can try that. And you still have your action, so you can kill them. Who says mustn't kill? That's a silly thing to say. Right. <laughs> More doggies as well. All right. This has the face of the derpiest spider. <laughs> uh, 
<sighs> should get rid of that wire weed. We need some obliterators. Uh, you can buy some obliterators as well. Another enemy's turned up there. You could do with another building. What do you need, particularly? We need energy. Don't have any good energy buildings here. We also do with some food. Got no food buildings there. It really doesn't matter. <laughs> you, you can build some good food buildings though. No, you're opposite as well. Alright, the food must have been up here. This was research, wasn't it? You got some energy as well. Put one of those there. What do these things give you? Food and research. Influence and loyalty. Loyalty. Or an influence. Influence and loyalty. Cool. Alright. Now we're going to get the smoke launcher. Yeah, we'll get the smoke launcher. Uh, yep. I'll get him into there and see how we can do. But I'm going to have to kill this guy off first. You can't do it. But you can throw a melter bomb on that. That's going to be terrible. <laughs> Who would have thought melter bombs would actually suck against, you know, armored targets? It's fine. You can at least shoot that out. Right. Now what are you going to do for me? You do 17.4 25.6 See that's a nice amount of damage Okay Oh you got to level up Okay a Ico blood increase allied chance. That's uh, actually a useful passive because if you get a lot of other Chaos Marine units, which all have the champion buff there, yeah, we'll grab that. Of course, you have to have the right units there, <laughs> which uh, not many of these are. You can run away and heal. And then we can get... who else is here? Where were those ambles? There they were. down he's run away but you just sit on that oh they give me extra ore yeah um
so many spawns. These guys all kind of need to heal up a bit. It's there. Oh, it's up here. They're really hard to see in there. <laughs> um. Oh, warp talons don't get the grenades. Okay. Well, I'll just kill them normally then. Uh, you. That's another health one. Or I can just kill that. Yep, 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 yep. It's all good. Ah, there's my Hell Drake. There we go. Um, Bale Flamer. So close range. That also has the. Ah, yeah, it uh, must be an explosive or whatever. Got the Demon Bone casings. Heavy reduces the accuracy after moving. But this is a vehicle, which... There we go. Uh, ignores cover. That's very useful. No escape. Increases the attacks against open-topped units. Has the soul blaze and is a template. So like frag grenades, it does more damage against large numbers. Uh, meteoric descent. Increased attacks against flyers. So that's a, an anti-flyer melee attack. Nice. It's a demon, it's got the vehicle armor, it's a flyer, a regen, and we've got Jink, which is a dodge thing, and the same demon forge that uh, these other guys have, them, Molfiends. Alright, you, let's uh, see if we can find some more <laughs> these wasps up here that keep running away. Yep, more of them, of course. I was just trying to get him out of the way so I could get more troops in. <laughs> really? Definitely going to need more energy buildings. Um, other than that, you don't really need to do anything. You can you you can build me an energy building there, please. Yeah, should get the population before that turns up. Uh, but unfortunately, that is all the time I have for this episode, so thanks very much for watching, and I will talk to you next time.